All new at 11, the future of Eastland Yards is once again in limbo. Tonight, Charlotte City Council was expected to vote between two project proposals for the old Eastland Mall site. Instead, council delayed the vote, telling the two developers to collaborate together on a new plan. WCNC Charlotte's Julia Kaufman joins us live in Uptown with those details. Julia. Hey guys, yeah, the two proposals for Eastland Yards are QC East and an indoor sports complex. City Council has unanimously agreed to task the developers behind those projects to combine their plans. Monday's meeting was packed with people rallying behind both proposals to develop the 29 acre site known as Eastland Yards. We have several concerns about the QC East plan. The first being affordability and accessibility. It's about youth, it's about accessibility, it's about affordability, and it's about a great plan for Eastland. In August, a city council committee endorsed QC East, a project promising to deliver sports fields, an amphitheater, food village, and technology hub in the Eastland Yard site. Some are excited about the plans. One of the things that we're able to do with the esports component is provide opportunity. Others think the sports complex offering indoor multi-use courts, a gym, learning center, and outdoor fields is a better fit. This option is the best option and the only option that benefits and works in the best interest of East Charlotte. Now, council has tasked the developers to collaborate to get the best of both worlds. Leaders specifically asked them to focus on an indoor sports complex, outdoor fields, esports, food, and retail. The idea is to get the very best of each part of this. It's another delay, but leaders are hopeful it's a big step forward to find the best solution for the longtime vacant land. The developers are expected to present their hybrid plan to the city in 45 days. In Uptown, Julia Kaufman, WCNC Charlotte. Julia, thank you.